hi my beautiful Sagittarius welcome to my channel my name is Natasha goddess of life 1111 if you are new to my channel welcome if you are returning subscribers welcome back this reading is for my lovely beautiful Sagittarius Sun Moon rising Venus and Jupiter this is a general love reading. It won't resonate with everyone. If this reading is not resonate with you, please check out your other chart placement for more clarity. Take what resonates and leave the rest. Thank you, God. Thank you, universe. Universal energy. My sister must pray, God. The pure white light. I can draw Michael, ascended masters. Please give my lovely, beautiful Sagittarius a clear, precise, honest message. Thank you. Thank you. Energies are fluid. If this reading is not resonate with you, it's not resonate with you. Okay. So thank you to all my sages that have been supporting my channel. I love you guys and I'm sending tons of love, light, and blessing your way. So if you guys would like, I uh, for those of you Sagittarius that are joining my Patreon, thank you so much. And I do post two healings videos so far and please guys check it out and it's only five dollars to join if you like to join me um, just everything is in the description box below okay let's get this reading flow oh I love it you have the wheel of fortune challenging time so for some of you you like very guarded <laughs> for some of you you are very guarded there's a brand new beginning for you it could be finance but you're not seeing it because you blocked off everything the will of fortune in here the fact that you black in your heart it could be a love relation it could be a lover that coming towards you that's gonna offer you something very tangible here but i feel like because you black your heart you're unable to see it because you black your solar plexus chakra your ears you know you're not hearing the universe is trying to you know warning you telling you that hey i need you to unblock so solar plexus chakra i need you to unblock your heart there is no more fight but the thing is that i understand you don't want to fight you don't want to argument you prepare for battles at the same time so it's like it's just like you you know you're like I'm, you're tired i feel like you're exhausting so whatever this is and stuff like that you know this is going to be a challenge for you but i felt like the will of fortune and here the divine timing is in your is on your side for you to look at it it's time for you to be successful it's time for things to change in your favor here that's what i'm feeling for you my beautiful side g's seek this seek you choose see success and growth I can't make this up. I've already said that. Here you are. You know, there's some something you need to find out here regarding someone, you know, a job, a partner, whatever. But they're asking you to seek the truth. And I feel like you're going to find it too. Because with the will of fortune and stuff like that in here, you're going to find whatever you are looking for. Definitely control. You could be dealing with a Leo here. Ooh, love abounds. Look at that. A brand new ace of cups. Cancer by Scorpio and um, you know, <laughs> Leo energy. So this is you could be dealing with one of these people. But if you are trying to find the truth, it shall because success, you could be success, you know, if you're not trying to be, you know, if you're not trying to be like I'm not saying you're being deceitful, Saji. I'm just saying you're like more watching someone. I feel like you are really you watching someone instead of take action. But whomever this person is, there's someone in here wants to offer you a brand new cup of love. Brand new love. Like, oof, this look beautiful. Like, it's this person is also watching you. They want to heal with you. They want to heal your heart. So whatever this is, I feel like you, the one who's watching someone here, you know, I feel like you try to find, you know, some type of truth, you know, when it's come to someone and he with the seven of swords. But I don't feel like this person is like a problem at all because I feel like you resisting this, you know, this person and there's when no love, you know, this person is also wearing a helmet. Let's say that, you know, 
they've been watched over by the universe so but i don't think like this person is hiding anything instead they might be more close off and you know close off to um relationship but nothing else flirt is at the bottom and i will quite it love is after that mm -mm. see release your ex so sagittarius you could be holding to someone else you could be holding to an ex that's not this over here express your love mm -hmm. romantic feelings yeah someone is gonna come toward you very fast and say listen sir ma'am i am very attracted to you i have feelings for you um yeah that's what someone is about to come in someone is about to make their feelings known oh i like it yeah someone is coming to you saji to make their feelings known keep an open mind yeah <sighs> they're asking this person to keep an open mind because this someone in here is not afraid of sharing their feelings so they're gonna make their feeling known so can order the bottom the devil mm, okay so they ask this person to keep an open mind when it's come to you, Sagittarius. Because you, you could be hold on to an ex. Because this is more like the four of principles. And express your love. So this person will go on to tell you how they feel. And they, the universe is trying to encourage you here to express your love to someone here. Mm -hmm. all right sagittarius let's not mess up with that good old love right <laughs> oh my goodness oh the empress mm -hmm. i mean the, the high priestess okay who's dealing with an empress sagittarius so i'm guessing you dealing with an empress that is your ex okay we get that out of the way quick the high priestess not this empress see the death card there's something that's supposed to be in someone could be dealing with a scorpio here or cancer Pisces scorpio but i felt like someone is hiding something someone they're supposed to be in it with see the hierophant of course my sagittarius is in a committed relationship hmm even if you're not with this person per se, I feel like there's still a committed a committed relationship. There could be still, you know, the divorce hasn't final yet, or you guys never filed a divorce and stuff like that. But I feel like you're still with, there was a committed relationship here. See, five of inspiration. This is the five of ones that's usually gossiping, fight, conflicts, argument that's what i'm feeling here you're still with someone here that the universe is trying to push you to release this person but, mm -hmm, the queen of swords ouch yeah you could be dealing with the libra the tower who you are dealing with they are about to have a tower moment it's like because you're still in a commit you still committed to someone here they are about to have a tower moment once they tell you the truth, they is gonna bring them a tower moment here. Eight of cups, eight of emotions. Someone is trying to walk away after the tower. Ooh, three of cups, eight of cups, three of cups. Ooh, someone is walking into the happiness. They wants to leave this, so that's a good thing. Someone is gonna walk straight to their own happy ending. Saji, we're gonna use Morgan Gray card to clarify for you. Let's go for the Hierophant for my Sagittarius, please. Ah, Ace of Cups. See? Someone is coming to offer you a brand new love offer. There you are. Mm -hmm. Or they are really did offer you bring <laughs> that love offer that bring them the tower. Clarify the Ace of Cups. Ah seven of cups so you are with someone you currently with someone right and then someone hot heavy and bother sexy attractive 
come by straight <laughs> sweep you off your off your feet so this person say i love you i want to be with you i have feelings for you and then bam you love oh dang what am i supposed to do i'm still in a commitment now you confuse because if you confuse that's mean that from time to time you're still messing around with the ex because the seven of cups here the seven of cups with the ace of cups is that you confuse someone offer you love and then you like what you confused because someone is still in a committed something here clarify the seven of cups yeah the knight of pentacles because what you want you know what this person want is a commitment i'm just gonna be i'm being straight blunt honest with you someone want a commitment they offer you a cup of love but you're confused because <clears throat> you don't know you're still in a uh something oh look at that that's beautiful 411 yes the tower yeah you both end up with a tower because someone in here is still committed wow the tower mm. <laughs> for once yeah someone bring you bring your stability into words into shaking the, the four yeah the four of ones clarify the four of ones for saji yes i i can't make this up ten of cups so you basically you basically still married you married whether it's a marriage whether it's a high commitment whether it's that beautiful relationship whatever this is and stuff like that you are in a committed the ten of cups it's a marriage card for me this you know happy wife happy life you know the the children you know what i'm saying so you guys are very and are committed you know whether you're happy you know, or not to each his own that's your problem but i feel like because they're asking you to release your ex and stuff like that which mean that you know you just in a co in a committed relationship just to be in one because whomever you are dealing with they come as the queen of swords which is they don't play <laughs> they don't play clarify the queen of voice see three of wands clarify the three of wands this is someone who ready to move forward they leave they leave the ex behind and moving forward so you're leaving the ex and moving forward the three of wands look at that the two of ones how you make a decision you like okay you already manifest what you want you're making a decision now to move on to move forward Clarify for the two of ones please for saji yes 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 with the ten of pentacles i mean for good gracious oh stability 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 yep so you know what to do here my lovely Sagittarius, you have the most beautiful, beautiful energy here. The only thing you have to do is to let go of your ex. Because if you don't let go of this ex, you are about to have a shake up into something you build to last. Because this is about long term stability. This is about long term financial stability, home marriage, everything you can think of. You know, with the Wooster here, that telling me that this is like you know something you will have you know that will go continue build growing and things like that so you're not going sitting there messing up by holding to an x just all this knight of pentacles is about commitment commitment 10 of uh and it's also about ending so you know 10 is a completion so you are in a committed relationship is what they say whatever you try to do it's either you stay or you go. But this is a very beautiful 9, 10, 10. So this is about ending. Also, the tower is about ending. So get to it, Masaji. <laughs> Let's clarify for this person you are dealing with. Yeah. Because the Queen of Pentacles is about stability, honey. The stability. They're like putting an end to it. You both have the tower though. They have the tower for this person. Oh. Two of cups. You're dealing with someone that's very bold. Someone that's, you know, um, the soulmate here going the tower. Let me see why. Four of swords. 
because someone in here thinking about you heavily they someone in here will hold on to the truth though you have a soulmate they know they are your true soulmate so with the four of swords that's what i'm feeling here yeah four of wands but you know there's instability to being with this person you know there's instability with this person so end up being rejected and offered here for stability because you are in a committed relationship mm. clarify the eight of emotions please ten of cups who you supposed to be saji <laughs> What? This is someone that's very unstable. This person is unstable. But they still want the Ten of Cups with you. Yeah, they want the whole shipping, the whole family, the happy wife. Someone wants, you know, that's what they want with you. And I don't think this person is ended yet. Page of Cups, because they're going to come in and telling you that. So it's a lot of ending in between you guys. Ten of Cups, Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. The tower, the tower. Mm. Clever, the page of cups, please, for Saji. Oh. You could be dealing with a Leo, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This person is, they are unstable. Home life, the home life is shaken up. They see you as the sun. They get clarity. This person get clarity. They're very abundant though. They're transforming everyone that's come around them. They make people happy. This is someone that's very happy, very jolly. They make people happy that's come around them. So they make people they make people feel very warm. That's what I'm feeling here. Some uh for some of you Sagittarius Sagittarius with this sun and the uh page of cups here, someone could be pregnant with a water sign baby this child could be a, a water sign clarify three of emotions please four of pentacles in the reverse you let it go of this someone letting go of you clarify the page of pentacles in the reverse two of swords someone they release you. Someone is releasing a third party. Oh, I like it. Sagittarius. Someone releasing a third party. They no longer hold on to a third party, but now they feel black. Two of swords. Why are you with? Oh. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Seven of. Someone also released. This person also released. The, uh, you know, they release the options, they're releasing the, you know, the only thing is that I felt like this person is making a decision. They are trying to make a decision here to release, uh, you know, the options, the third party, the third party is over with. They're done. They're done with the third party. They are working on it. So, because they, they know that it's make them unstable. To be in a third party relationship they know that if they have to come towards you they have to to have their wish fulfillment they have to let go yeah six of cups yeah this person is they want to be with you they're dead serious <laughs> someone is very persistent on being with you i'm just telling you why is the four of wands is in the reverse please someone is very persistent in being with you because you you know you make this person happy. Or they make you happy. But someone in here said that, you know, you make me happy. See, the Knight of Swords. Oh. <sighs> they really, this person really thinking about you heavily. They really want to for this to work, yeah. They want that offer you that cups and that is oh oh okay look at that gifts in cups yeah someone is you want to offer you everything i want to give you everything yeah someone want to offer you love and 
some gifts. You got gifts coming towards you. Because this person don't want to be with the third party. This person is changing the whole outlook. They're changing their, their ways just to be with you. Wow. Yep. And the universe say hell to the no, no, no. Yep. You got the no, Saji. She look like she's sad. Blessing in abundance. So the universe said, this is what we're going to do. You say no. We got you. Blessing in abundance. And then I feel like they know is to release your ex. The noise for X because there's a surprise coming for you. I don't feel like this is gonna to be about this person though. It's about going to be over here. Because guess what? You got a yes. <laughs> you got a yes. Because someone here is your two of cups. This person is healing, they're missing you, they're showing this. Over here, you know, is it what someone, so you could be in here with someone that you're already in a relationship with, that you try to let go of. They told you to know to let go of this person because you got some abundance um, coming with someone here from, some, from someone from your past. That will bring you exactly the happiness, the joy, the comfort. Whatever you're looking, they say yes. I cannot show it enough. This is beautiful. But you have to release an ex to have that blessing and abundance. You have some type of blessing in disguise you're not seeing coming. Oh, this is beautiful. Okay, Saji. I love you guys. Bye, Sagittarius. Don't forget to join my Patreon. There's healing video there already. Bye.